Hello, in this video, I'm going to show you how to familiarize yourself with your buckets that you're responsible for as a referral coordinator. So as you go into the task list tab and look in your drop down, you will see a number of buckets used that you have for your responsibility. So the first one I'm going to go over is the inbound referrals. So if I click on inbound referrals, so in here are all the inbound document set tasks that you will have to be dealing with. And we've made a series of videos that show you exactly how to do that. So we'll skip that for now. The next bucket that you need to be concerned about is the referral task bucket. So in this bucket, you can see a number of tasks that are assigned to you. And you can see that the task is set as financial auth. Basically, all of these tasks are orders that your provider has created for their patients. And now you have a task to follow up and make that referral happen. Let's talk about what we see here. So we have, the again, the name of the task, financial auth, the name of the patient, we have the name of the doctor. It says assigned to, but what that is is that that's the doctor that assigned the task to you. It was created by the system or the EHR, the data it was created on, and the status of the task. Now, you can go ahead and sort any of these columns by clicking on the name of the column at the very top. So if I wanted to sort by the date of these tasks, I can just click on the created on, and it will first put the oldest at the top. And if I click it again, it'll put the newest to the top. So however you want to sort them, just click on create it on and that will allow you to see the order by date. If I wanted to sort them by the status, because there are two different statuses, active and in progress, I can click on status and it will sort all, it'll put all the active ones on top. And if I had any in progress ones, it would now put the in progress ones up top, but I don't have any in progress ones in this bucket. Let me show you another bucket that has in progress tasks in it. Here's one right here. So if I click on status, now all the active are at the top if I click on it again, all the in progress are at the top. And so that's how you can sort it. So there's one other bucket that you need to be familiar with, and that is your personal bucket called My Active Tasks. And that's the very top of your list. You click on that. And in this bucket are going to be tasks that have been personally sent to you by staff or providers. You'll have to deal with them on a one by one basis. And all you have to do is click on each one. In the comment section, it will allow you to see what it is you have to deal with concerning that patient. And that's how you sort and familiarize yourself with the buckets that you were responsible for as a referral coordinator.